Hello, I'm Jordan Raven and today I'm going to review the Yamaha GL1. It comes in this case, uh, which, which is called a gig bag, but I don't see anything that can help you regarding a gig because there's no pockets or anything. It opens from the bottom, which is weird. But yeah, this is the Yamaha GL1. It is a rosewood fretboard and a spruce wood body. And it is about 71 centimeters in length. This guitar is tuned in A standard and is pretty much the best uh, instrument to carry if you're touring and you play guitar. This is good for practice. And it also has small frets which you can maneuver easily. Right now I'll play a few tunes so that you can see how it sounds. See how it sounds. <laughs> right now I'm going to play a few tunes or a few riffs so that you can hear how it sounds. This is the standard E major. These are the individual strings. Uh, again, these are in A standard tuning, so they'll be way higher than the normal standard tuning of a guitar, which is in E standard. So it does sound a bit high pitched, but you can play about the same things that you can play on the normal guitar in the same positions. Like I can play a tornado assault. Then Are You Mine by Arctic Monkeys. You can play something like Poets of the Fall. These are how scales sound on it. One thing I like to do on this guitar is that it's very small and you can maneuver very fast. So sliding is very good even with chords like... If you're just a campfire guitarist or even a pro guitarist, this guitar would be good for you, especially if you travel a lot, because this is very small, portable. You can, um, you can basically retune it very easily with nylon strings, which are very cheap. So if you travel, tour around, uh, this is a good guitar so that you don't lose time while practicing. And also, if you want to play for friends or family, wherever you go, it's a good option. It's barely about 150 or 200 grams. So you can carry it everywhere without any hindrance. So if you do want to buy the guitar, there's a link down below. You can go through it. It is an affiliate link, so I will get a cut of if you buy it. And um, yeah, that's about it. If you did find this video good, um, I will not post more videos regarding <laughs> reviews of instruments. So uh, subscribe at your own risk and like at your own risk. <laughs> but I do post random videos and I plan on posting consistently so if you do like my personality you can subscribe I guess I can play something in drop D that's the default for metal edge drop all the guitars to D and run away from the guitar store